friends. So um, I'm shooting a bunch of videos tonight. So I want to take a second and I want to do an unboxing and review of an Evolution um, circular saw. Let's see what they call this thing. So this is a Rage 185 millimeter circular saw. So what I like about it is it cuts metal. $99. I can hardly build, buy a skill saw for $99. So, um, we got a manual. It does come with a, um, a miter gauge and a Allen key. Really nice. Comes with earplugs. Yeah, that's cute. I'm going to throw those away. Throw them away because I don't think you should be using them. I'm throwing them away because I have earmuffs, which I think do a better job and are therefore more likely to be used. Oh, it even included free safety goggles. That's kind of cool. Save those for later. And one of the things I really like about Evolution as a tool company is their stuff comes ready to use. If the, I don't ever trust the factory to tighten my saw blades. So the first thing I want to do is I want to engage the lock. I want to twist this. And I want to just make sure that this saw blade is locked in good and tight. It is. All right, that makes me feel better. Now I'm going to look for a place to store this because these guys are so good about making functional tools. Oh man, did they really let me down and not have a place to store this? All right, guys. Evolution, I hope you're watching my video. Why didn't you mold a slot into the handle that I could slide this into and get it out of the way so I don't lose it? Man, y'all disappoint me. Such wonderful tools. It's tool porn. Okay, they call it tool can. They only call it what it is. It's tool porn. All right? And it doesn't have a slot. So, first things first, their tools are advertised as being multi-purpose. So, let's see. Is it really multi-purpose? Hmm, let's find out. But in a pinch, I might. And it does a great job. It's every bit as good as every other circular saw I've ever owned. So here's some T60-61 aluminum. I think it's 60-61. Might be 6501. I can't. Yeah, it might very well be 6501 because it's got a T651 marking on it. And this is something an ordinary circular saw won't do. It's cutting fine, but the board is moving. All right, so if you watch very many of my videos, one of the things you're going to hear me say over and over and over again is safety takes a second, accidents are instant. That's what I mean. You know, could I wedge through this? I probably could, but it'd be very, very easy to get hurt. So I'm going to take a second and I'm going to make this a safe cut. because it's not safe to cut something that's moving. That's where kickback comes from. That's where people lose their fingers and their hands and have really bad days. And I'm not interested in having a bad day. It just take a second to put another clamp on.
No problem. Um, you know, these cuts aren't perfect, but for shearing the aluminum, no problem. Um, I would be good with making a triangular cut. In fact, I'm going to make a triangular cut because that's the stuff. I'll save that for TIG practice. Um, triangular cuts, you know, it's, it's a nightmare to make little brackets and stuff. So I'm not following a guideline and I'm just kind of winging it. So I am get I was getting a little pushback there. And you can see here the cut's not quite square, but but for making a quick triangle, yes, absolutely works. Um, if I was doing something that was um, critical, I would draw a line and I'd follow it. Heck at that point I might even use a bandsaw. But but this is quick and dirty. I like it. This is a this is a good tool. You know, where this would really pay for itself is cutting, um, making accurate cuts in sheet or plate. Um, you know, that's, you know, I have a plasma cutter. It, it doesn't do anything this accurately um, or this quickly. So plasma cutter's messy, it's loud, it makes, it shoots hot sparks everywhere. So I like it, $99. Everybody that does metalworking should have one of these. I mean, it's just that simple. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you found this interesting. Um, HomeDepot.com, sell, they sell these for $99 with free shipping. Uh, if you go to Amazon, they're about $180. Um, I think the people on Amazon are just buying them from Home Depot and shipping them. Um, you know, they're really expensive everywhere except Home Depot. And this is a, this is a Rage 1B, but I'm extraordinarily happy with this. Highly recommend it. Um, there are a couple minor things that I would do differently. I'd, I'd put a bracket. I'd put somewhere to hide that Allen key um, like I've seen Walt do. Um, but uh, thanks for watching my video. hope you find it interesting. Please like my video. Please subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my videos. Um, it, it's just the stuff that I'm interested in, and so the videos do kind of vary run the gamut. Thanks for watching.